Well, as we continue to march through winter, it'll be tempting for you to try and get out on frozen lakes and ponds, but are you doing it safely? Fox 55's Caleb Saylor tells us how you can keep yourself safe on the ice this winter. People will be taking to area lakes and ponds this winter to enjoy some outdoor fun. However, it's important to learn and relearn how to keep safe while on the ice. Every year, local fire departments and the DNR are called to scenes to rescue people and pets from icy waters. Without being careful, you could unexpectedly be in the water yourself. The Indiana Department of Natural Resources posted a helpful guide to know when it's safe to go out on the ice. And while you won't see Godzilla or an at, -at on the ice, it's still a good idea to follow the guidelines. Realize that no ice is safe ice. There's only minimum recommendations that we can make. If there's not at least four inches of good clear ice, you should stay off of it. That's the minimum given to support a person. Another tip inexperienced ice sport enthusiasts might not know. You don't want to go on any ice where there is moving water underneath it or if there is, you know, an outlet, whether that be in a pond, geothermal, or, you know, some of these creeks that dump into the local lakes, stay away from the ice around there because moving water can degrade the ice thickness and make it unsafe to go out on. Test the ice with an auger near the edge. If it meets the thickness requirements, you're good to go. If you can't tell or if you see a red light on some area ponds, stay off the ice. And when you go out on the ice, you should always wear a life jacket or a float coat. Have ice picks to break the ice if you do fall in, wear slip-on spikes to help keep grip, and if you're near shore, tether a rope to a tree or dock to help pull yourself to shore if you fall in, and never go out on the ice alone. Around the area, lakes are starting to freeze over, but as rain and warmer temperatures move in, that'll start to decrease, so use caution when going out on ice. If you do venture out on unsafe ice, you're not only putting yourself at risk, but you're putting all the first responders that may have to come to your rescue at risk. So it it's, is not worth it to go out on unsafe ice. In Tri-Lakes, meteorologist Caleb Saylor, Fox 55 News.